What's up guys, War here, welcome back to the channel. Again, we are in hour 20 of our 24 hour stream. This is our first one we ever did. And we are now level 50 into the end game. And we are going to be doing our very first world boss that we've seen announced or seen during our playthrough. Okay guys, so over here you can see on the map, world bosses spawn just like they normally do. Normally we used to see them all the way over here in the crucible but now the world boss has spawned down here for the very first time sort of south of czar biznet so um in here you can see these world bosses it's level 55 plus and it says slay the world boss we got about five minutes till it begins and it says ashava the pestilent avarice the gold cursed or uh and the wandering death have been occasionally been seen at this location what this means is that once the timer starts at 30 minutes, it doesn't say which world boss it is. It gets down to about five minutes or 10 minutes, I think it was. And then it shows you exactly which boss that you're going to be fighting. But it can be any one of those three. Now, this is the very first world boss that I've seen since launch last night. So we are going to like just have an absolute blast with this boss. Um, we've never fought this boss before because the Shava the Pestilent has been the only one that we've got to fight. So we are going to fight this one and I'll try to bring out like some tips and tricks maybe after and just kind of go back over it with you guys. But until then, I'm going to really enjoy the fight and it's going to be awesome. It's level 55 plus. Um, and then this also accounts towards your, uh, your excuse me your tree of whispers as you guys can see we get five grim favors it takes 10 to turn in so doing this is also going to help you get halfway done for your tree of whispers which is really really cool um, once you defeat a world boss you're going to get your weekly bonus spoil and as you can see it expires in two days and 14 hours so you can hold on to this if you want kind of stack them up and then you know just open them all up at once kind of like you know bounty caches from diablo 3 etc so um you can really do that um, hopefully I'll have some tips for you for this boss fight, but this is going to be really, really cool. This is going to be a first time ever seeing this boss uh, and experiencing it live. I know we've seen trailers and stuff, but this boss is going to be really cool. So we are fighting Avarice the Gold Cursed. Ten seconds left, guys. First time ever fighting him. Excuse me. Here we go. I hope he spawns some goblins. This is going to be lit. This is going to be lit. Oh boy! Just stand under his butt. Just stand under his booty. Okay, mister. Oh yeah, we're gonna dominate you. Oh, somebody's got the landslide. Let's go. I love it. Watch out for the portal. Oh my god. Alright, the portal's lit. Portal's lit. Guys, we need some more CC out of you. Rogues, where are you guys at? Where's my rogues at? We need, we need some more CC. Okay, so all you got to do, really, it looks like when fighting Avarice, the gold curse, is just stand under his butt, man. Stand under... Stand under oh! Stand under his big booty. We're going to go. We're going to go. We're going to go pulverize. We're going to go big. We're going we're gonna to activate Grizzly Rage here. Oh, okay, okay. You got to be careful of those. See these little pockets here? See a little gold? It's like smog right here. It's like we're fighting smog. You just gotta be careful. It's kind of like a Shava's poison pockets there. Ooh, the question is, do goblins spawn out of those? That'd be cool. Get CC, punk. Okay, we got this. We got this. This is nothing. This is nothing. World boss. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, okay. Avarice, all right. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. Holy crap, man. He's trying to take me down. I must wait a moment. I don't like that, bro. Oh, 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 oh. Watch out for the spinny thing. Do not stand outside. Do not stand outside. We're going Grizzly Rage again. Come and get some of this. Come say hi to your daddy. Oh, 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 oh. He did a little spinny action. That's all right. We're fortitude out of his mind. Oh, oh, okay, okay. I must right. wait him. Yeah, you just stay under. Okay, when he goes through those portals, you just gotta stand out of the way when he comes back through him, okay? It's pretty easy. Stand out of his gullet there. Oh, he likes to puke? Oh, that's disgusting. That's not cool, man. Okay, okay, his little spinny thing is a little too close for me, and I don't appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? I'm not ready yet. I've been doing nothing but whooping his ass. And he's gonna like it. 
Oh, watch out for the watch out for the gold. Oh, the gold explosions. You gotta be careful of those. Oh, he just did he just monkey charge me? All right, all right. Grizzly rage again. I just want to let everybody know, Asmund Gold would be so proud of me because I am like tanking right now with the druid. I'm doing all the damage. So, and I'm just wrecking this guy's face. All right, so we got him halfway through. We're not doing too good on our CC to to go ahead and get a um, a stagger out of him. But you know what? It's okay. I think I think I got him figured out. So when he drops those gold things down, all you want to do is just not be in those ways. When he goes through the portal, it's pretty predictable. You can definitely just kind of trigger that, guys. Uh, when you're standing underneath his tail, his Godzilla tail, you just got to stand out of the gold. And you see the gold on your screen kind of light up when you're standing in it. See that? So you, as long as that's how you know when you're in the gold or you're not in the gold. So, um, and that is some damage over time. That's going to be like poison almost. It's like you're standing in hot gold, uh, which is really cool. Um, I'm going Grizzly Range again because I'm just going to show him who his daddy is. And uh, when he does this little spin thing, you're pretty safe underneath his tail um, for the most part. Oh, we got a stagger. Let's go. Let's go. Unleash. 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 Okay, this is the best guy to fight uh, Avarice the Gold Cursed because he's just a big old punk, dude. He's a big old punk. You know what I'm saying? I'm over here just... I wish I could see the damage numbers at the end because you guys would be so surprised. Again, those are when he smashes down his big chest is when he summons those gold, um, like pillars, and then that's when it, they'll explode. It's you can definitely get out of the way of those, but otherwise you just stand exactly underneath his Godzilla tail, no problem. Okay, now if you can't take the, like tank the heat, like I did from the from the gold, like like that burns you, then don't stand underneath. Just try to move out of the way. Um, but the safest place is still underneath him. You may take some damage from him uh, doing his spin because that's a really close spin. But otherwise, like, it's pretty easily... Like, it's not bad. It's just like the Ashava fight, I'm going to say, guys. And we're about to crush him in five minutes, okay? Because he's just... You know, it really pisses me off because he didn't give us any goblins and all this gold. So, boom! Avery is the gold cursed absolutely dominated we got a grand cash we got a sacred two-handed axe a ring and some nice little resources here oh oh we can beat down the treasure chest let's go that's cool bonus bonus loot okay now i'm mad he didn't give us any goblins now i'm not mad about that anymore that was not too shabby at all we got our very first world boss defeated now let's go ahead and take a look at the loot because that's what we care about crit strikes with our core skills give us attack speed and then our sacred two-handed axe is Deal 50% increased damage while you have a barrier. Ooh, that is spicy. That is a good one. All right, let's take a look at our Avarice Spoils. And it's a count bound, and hopefully he gives us something good. Pop those. Okay, Watchman Nightmare Sigil. Sigil? A ring and some stuff. So let's see, what is our ring here? Earth Spikes. Earth Spike launches spikes in a line and has a two and a half second cooldown. Interesting. I've never seen that one, really. Now, the consumables here. Now, this is where it's really cool with the world bosses that you guys may not know of, but they do drop Nightmare Sigils. Okay, Nightmare Sigils, as you guys know, these are what turn uh, normal dungeons into Nightmare Dungeons, which gives you a lot better loot. It adds dungeon affects to make the dungeons really nice and unique. And, yeah. So, uh, this is really, really cool, man. That's our very first world boss fight. I'm looking forward to these. And remember, guys, you get five points towards your um grim favors which is just excellent so now all we got to do is go find another world boss or go do a dungeon which is really cool now i do want to note before signing off guys that the world bosses spawns are completely random to my knowledge okay they spawn at random times throughout the day it could be multiple times it could be just once I don't know exactly how often they're going to spawn. So before you ask me down in the comments, I do not know. I wish I had that answer for you, but I've been playing for 20 hours or excuse me, I'm sorry, 18 hours. And this is the first world boss that has spawned. So yeah, um, if you guys have any more information on that, let me know down in the comments. Maybe you guys can help me out. So uh, like the video if you guys did enjoy it. Be sure to uh, comment down below and let me know what you think. Be sure to subscribe, guys. We're on our way to 10K before 6'6". I'd really help if you... Uh, it would really help if you help me out 
Yeah, I'm good at I'm good at signing off, guys. As always, stay game. I've been awake for too long, okay? I've been awake for like 28 hours or something like that, all right? Okay, give me a break. All right, guys, stay gaming. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.